Mark Teixeira's takeout slide on Tuesday night fired up the Yankees' offense, but it also kept Tex out of the lineup on Wednesday with a bruised right ankle. And the Rangers took advantage. Andy Pettit was forced out of his last start due to back problems. Scott Feldman started the season in the bullpen and went to the rotation. He's been great. 4 0, 3.9, one less than a hit per inning. Came back and won four in a row. 2 2. Right back up the middle off the leg of Pettit, and everybody's going to be safe as a run scores. That'll be a single for Cruz. It might have been a double play if it got past Pettit, but that's somewhat questionable. He slowed it down with his body, but it uh, ricocheted away from Robinson Cano. Again, ball away. Cruz goes up the middle. Going to get off Andy Shin. I'm sure he'll feel that for the night's so. over. So curveball down. Ouch. What do you think, Paul? You think that Cano makes a double play on that? I don't know. That ball's a sports journey. It's been lingering, and uh, that's why they finally shut him down. The 0-1. Ground ball to Jeter. Backhanded. He goes to second one, and that's all they get. Run scores. It's 2-0 Texas. Good play by Jeter, ranging to the backhand side. You know, anytime a, a shortstop has to move to his right, chances are you're not going to turn a double play. Jeter makes a great play here. Big thing is, you know, get the ball to Robinson Cano, who made a good stretch. Get that one out. Not the first time you've seen Jeep going to his right there. He seems real comfortable with that. You see Andy Pettit cheering him on. Got that one out. Order with Davis and Sata Lamacchia. That one is looped to right field. Coming on as Cabrera is going to dunk in for a base hit. One run scores. Bird goes to third. And he's out. Good throw by Melky Cabrera to end the inning. Bird tried the 2 2. Swing and a miss. And the 1 1. Right drive. Base hit. Left field. Swisher rounds third. Here he comes. He'll score. It's an RBI single for A Rod. Yankees on the board. It's 3 1 Texas. You know, right before this pitch was thrown, I was just going to say, you know, this is when Alex Rodriguez has to worry about just driving that run in. But I tell you what, this is a single, but this ball was hammered. It was hit so hard that it kind of took the left fielder out of his rhythm and pulling to, to home plate. No throw. That ball is just hit hard. Murphy moving towards the line had no chance at Swisher, especially with two outs. But good piece of hitting by Alex Rodriguez. I mean, you, you score a lot of runs by just driving in people with singles. Completely different. Three two. Punched out and passed a lunging Swisher and down the right field line. Andre scores. Malky comes up ready to throw. And a base hit for Ian Kinzer and RBI. And it's now 4 1 Texas. And the black bat had a hit in it. See that? But I tell you what, an infield back possibly. But you look at a good piece of hitting right here. Ball away. Ian Kinzer, you talked about how good a player he was. Infield in, hit it hard somewhere. Good chances it's going to go through. Swisher, good effort right down the line, though. He can't get to it. Trust the catcher and be on the same wavelength as him. Runners go. Double steal, swan and miss, no throw. And Posada fell down. I don't know if he got hurt there. I got hit with the bat. That looked like a hit and run. And, and they're going to send the runners out. back yeah. here with, uh, because of interference. So Ron Washington is going to argue with Hunter Wendelstead. We'll see how he got hit on the replay, but he uh, he was staggered like he'd been hit with a punch. And again, that's in, that's in slow motion. It doesn't look like much, but in a full swing, I mean, that's a hit and run. Obviously, he went out of the zone, but he comes back and Hits him with a barrel of the bat right in the ribs. I'll tell you what you see, Georgie's absolutely just gotten crumbled right there. It's like a punch. Like a kidney punch almost. It was a little too high for the kidney. But he was staggered. So the runners have to be sent back. And the pitch. Found it softly to third. They step on third across the diamond. It's a double play with Davis with the backhand scoop. 
So Alex on a 3-1 pitch hit the ball softly toward third. The perfect spot for Michael Young. He was able to just step on the bag and then fire across the diamond. So the Yankee rally comes up with absolutely nothing. They strand two and we go to the fourth inning. 4-1. Pitcher's gimping a little bit. Get over there, making an easy play. But the thing was, he made a good pitch. See Robbie hit one in the hole. Got him! What a play by Andres. Just got Cano. He doesn't agree with the call. We'll take a look. Gathers himself so he can get something on the throw. And we're going to see right here if it's a good bat. Or... Coors Light freeze cam. It's been close there. I don't know how. You see Nick Keller right there in the background. Got a good look at it. I think he got him. Good. Strike three. Oh. Ooh, right by him. Right now, you see how teams change all the time. And strike three to Nick Swisher. One, two. And he strikes out A Rod. The ball tonight, but all of a sudden, you know, a game off, and then the run production's down. That one's drilled deep to right field. Does it have the height? Yes. See ya. Solo home run Posada. It's 4 2 Texas. And you can see Burnett said, well, that's one. Boy, Posada is really swinging I'll tell you what, well. from last night to tonight, he's had some of the best at bats. And, and this ball right here, before I talk and get it out, it's going to be in the bleachers. That's just a dead two-iron line drive right down the line. And that's that cut fastball. That kind of in the third, two earned, and five Ks. Bring on Frank Francisco in the ninth. Hasn't allowed a road run all season long, and it gets Melky Cabrera to pop up the second to end the ball game. Rangers win 4-2. Francisco, a perfect 12 for 12 and save opportunities this season. Scott Feldman, 5-0. Four wins have come on the road. So the win for the Rangers gives them back the top record in the American League, taking over that one-day lead the Yankees had. Derek Jeter, he went 0 for 4 in the ball game, so his hitting streak has ended at 16 games.